Hey developers, today we're gonna look at my favorite Udemy courses. I'm gonna go over the ones that I recommend and also I'm gonna talk to you about some special deals that I have going on with Udemy right now. So let's begin. Hey, so here is the Udemy website. Um, by the way, if you don't, if it does look a little different, Udemy just redid their site. I kind of like it actually. I like the, the logo and uh, I think it's a little bit easier to search through. I mean, I, I, I like, I'm digging the design. I think it works great. By the way, if you see at the top here, there is a deal that you can get uh, discounted courses. Udemy does these about once or twice a month. But I actually have something special and I just want to get this out of the way. I'm a proud Udemy affiliate. If you do buy any Udemy products or courses using the links that I have below, I have all my links to some of my favorite courses that I'm going to explain in this video. I do get a couple bucks, so that's my disclaimer right away, right there. You know, I think they're a great service, so I do recommend them. In fact, I'm going to be creating my own courses eventually, and I'll probably be putting some up on Udemy. Probably not all of them, but some of them. Um, so the deal I have is, so if you look in the description of any of my videos, I have these links right here. And these are the links to the courses that I recommend and I've taken and I've gone through. Uh, right now, uh, if you click on any of these links, it'll pop up the page and you'll actually see right at the top, it says welcome program with Eric developers. So I, I'm having a special deal with Udemy right now. They contacted me and I said, cool, let's do it. So. Uh, right now, if you just go through to Udemy's website, if you're a brand new person that's never used Udemy, you can get $10 courses. Otherwise, it's normally $12. Um, but for me, it doesn't matter. If you use the links on my page, you get $10 courses. It doesn't matter if you're a new user or you've already bought uh, Udemy courses, you can get it. And so I thought that was really cool that they were able to do that for me. So the first course I wanna recommend is the Advanced Web Developer Bootcamp. And by the way, this sale ends very soon, I think the 30th, 31st. So if you're going to pick up some courses, it's a good idea to pick it up now. Um, there'll probably be another sale later, but just uh, pick it up now. I'm not sure if I'll be able to get you the same $10 deal then. So the first course I recommend is the Advanced Web Developer Bootcamp. I did a quick first impression of this bootcamp probably last week. I am actually still going to create a full on review of it where I go over um, all 27 and a half hours, go over the modules that I like, that I didn't like. I'm still in the process of going over it, but my first initial impressions were positive. Um, so I'm not gonna get too much into it here cause you're, I'm gonna have a whole other video and a whole complete review on it. And like I said, uh, I'm gonna be very hard on it. I'm gonna see what I like and don't like, but it seems to be pretty good for now. But I mean, any individual part, there might be better full courses for. And that's kind of the feedback I've seen from some of my users, but I'd still check it out for $10. The next one is the Web Develop Bootcamp. This is the first Colt Steel course. And like I said, all these links are below in the description. So you can click on any of them and get them. And I did do a review on this one. I did spend quite a few hours on this course. Uh, I thought it did lack in a few places, especially at the end where it went into some more advanced JavaScript concepts. I thought that was good, but not great. But overall, I mean, this has 42 and a half hours of content for $10. And uh, I think just just to check it out, it's worth it. Um, it's, I mean, he may even mentions that he used to teach boot camps and that would cost between $14,000, $21,000. And he even bolds this, only course you need to learn web development, which I always thought was funny. He puts that on there. I don't think, I, I said this in my review of this course that I don't think that's true. But once again, it's $10 and has a lot of great information. So that is why I recommend this course. The next course I recommend is JavaScript Understanding the Weird Parts. So this is kind of the, the parts of JavaScript that I wish was in these other, or the, the Web Developer Bootcamp. So this really goes into more solid version, uh, more in-depth versions of JavaScript. So the void common pitfalls and mistakes, prototypical inheritance, IIFE, um, in invoking functions, things like that. Stuff you might be asked on an interview of a JavaScript interview, I've noticed. This title kind of comes from the book, Understanding the uh, the Good Parts, kind of, kind of a play on that a little bit. 
So I definitely recommend this course, it goes over ES6. There is some newer JavaScript courses that have more advanced stuff in it. This, has, this uh, hasn't been updated in a little while, so I might be looking for some newer JavaScript courses to recommend, but this was the one I've recommended, and I, I'd still do. Uh, advanced JavaScript, uh, this was upgraded, updated 7.16, so it has a little bit more, but once again, this is, if you didn't think, if you thought this one might be a little too old, this has a few new newer things. Um, once again, it has some interview questions, has pretty some, you can get some more deeper fundamentals of JavaScript in general. I always think if you're a new developer, even if you're an intermediate developer, it's always good to kind of go over the basics every now and then. If you get mixed up in a framework and you haven't gone back to the basics in a while, it's really easy to forget some of these things because your framework is doing everything for you and you don't really need to go into like the individual stuff on that. And finally, I have Vue.js 2. So I'm a big fan of Vue, of course. Uh, there's another YouTuber called Maximilian Schwartzmuller. He has his own channel that I recommend his courses on. Um, so I'm creating my own. I actually, if you don't know, I have my own Vue.js 2 book that I'm creating right now. It should be out sometime the beginning of next year. And I'm also looking to create my own courses, but I've used this course um, of his as kind of a, a good primer to start off with. It has some good good things in it. So I would highly recommend him. And he's also a YouTuber, so I kind of want to shout out for him too. So these are the courses that I recommend here. There's a couple of more that, a um, couple of more I probably would, would take a look at if you just go into development. I'm just going to kind of go off the fly here course the web developer boot camp that we just talked about if you're interested in python there's the complete python boot camp i've actually heard of this course i haven't taken it but i heard good things about it so python's really hot uh java is pretty hot right now too so the complete java master course so let me just click on this and see what's in it so good it goes over java 8 it's fully functional um some a lot of good things there how to easily write advanced javascript uh, one second and how to program the right way cutting out the useless fluff and filler so once again you know you can looks like this course you can either be on Windows Mac or Linux and it has over 134,000 students so kind of when I look at courses on Udemy I look at the rating how many students have enrolled to kind of get an idea of uh, you know how established this is and it looks like there's tons of people have taken it so this might be a good course you can check out too uh, let's see here. Uh, game development. This is a pretty cool one. Jonathan Weinberger had a game development course here. I know I just did an interview with, with someone on um, last week talking about Unity 3D. So this might be a really cool course that you guys can take a look at if you want to learn Unity. Uh, game development with Unity 3D. So that's, that's pretty cool. And it's only $10. Like I said, any of these courses are always $10 if you use the link below that I have set up. Now let's take a look at a couple of more. Uh, iOS Swift. So that's something I've been looking forward to. Um, this is iOS 11 and Swift 4 app. I haven't taken these last couple of apps, but I mean, it looks kind of interesting. Once again, we have 21,000 students enrolled. We have almost five stars. So you can say that this is a pretty good course. It was just updated. So that that's really good. So we know that um, you know, you got the latest Swift here, iOS 11. We're not getting old technology. That's the problem with going with Pluralsight or somewhere else. You may find these courses, but they might be really old. So you'll end up getting like an iOS 10 course or iOS 9 or 8. And really, you want to, especially with iOS, you want the latest and greatest. So that's glad there's something here that just started, which is great. Um, and look at that, 37 and a half hours of content. And that's that's an amazing deal for ten dollars. So, I don't. I might even pick this up because I've been thinking about creating a, a Swift app too, just for fun of getting back into it. I actually did create an iOS app back in the day. Maybe somebody will find it one day. Um, it was a, a part of a community project for the city I'm in um, to help them out, and we it was part of a hackathon. And our app won, uh, didn't win anything. But it was kind of fun getting together with a bunch of random people in Reno and working on a, a project together. 
and it was an iOS. My, my part was the iOS part, which is really cool. So I think, I think that's, that's good enough for now. I mean, we've seen this, like there's just tons and tons of apps, especially for developers. Development is the biggest, I mean, I've talked to the people from Udemy, development is the like biggest section in their most popular courses for sure. Uh, oh, here's another one, HTML, CSS from beginner to advance. Um, that's just another HTML one. I need to actually practice up on my CSS, so I think I'm gonna probably get one of these CSS courses eventually too. So I think they'd be a good deal. So thank you for watching this video. We're just talking about some cool courses on Udemy. Definitely check out my link below. It's only available for the next couple of days. You can get these courses pretty darn cheap and also help out the channel, which is really awesome. If you like these type of videos, click that subscribe button and also make sure you uh, click that bell button too. And that will notify you next time I release a video. Thanks everybody.